Hi everyone, welcome to KSR Data Vision YouTube channel. In today's session, we will see how we can create a app from a SharePoint list. Uh, so this is my SharePoint and this is the list employee information list. And uh, I uh, so in my organization, these are the employees who are working under my uh, in, uh, in my organization. And I need a user friendly app where if any employee is joining uh, in my organization, I have to create new record and I have to enter the employee details. And if uh, someone is leaving my organization, I have to remove them from my source path and uh, any change in the employee information I have to update for doing all these operations, right? I need a user friendly app application. So let's see how I can achieve this using Power Apps without writing single piece of code. So this is my SharePoint list. Let's see how we will create now. So this is the home page of Power Apps and here you can see this option SharePoint. So click on the SharePoint. And here you can enter the SharePoint path. So you have to enter. This is my SharePoint. Uh, list name. So I will copy here. Give the source path here. Now it is showing me the list available in the SharePoint. So this is my employee information. So I'm selecting this connect. So Power Apps is readily creating app for me. I have not written a single line of code here. So it has created if you see here right tree view. This is the tree view here. You can see three screens. It has created one is browse screen detail screen and edit screen. So if you expand this browse screen here, you can see this is the browse screen. So all the records in that employee info list has been displayed here and uh, what all the text boxes or icons whatever. The controls are used here, so everything is automatically created here. I have not used any. I did not drag and drop anything or uh, I have not created anything. I have not written any function or any code here. Automatically the Power Apps has created this for me and in detail screen you can view the details of each record. And the uh, uh, components or the controls used that will be coming here and in the edit screen if you see how to edit that uh, each employee information, right? That screen also Power Apps has created for me. Now let's preview this app once, okay? Let's add, delete, and uh, modify each record. So this is the preview the app. So go here and click on this. So this is the app. Our app looks uh, something like this. And uh, let's edit this information, okay? Uh, so employee David, I want to edit this employees information so you can click on this. So the here you can view this employee information. So uh, his employee number, his name, what is his role and from which location he is. So these details you can uh, view it here. So if I want to edit this employee information directly, I can select this one. So David has upskilled himself. Uh, now he is no more a data scientist. He is a Azure data engineer. So I am updating his details here. And once I update the details, when I click on the submit, automatically my source will be updated. Let's check it out. David, right? Refresh this SharePoint once. Then only you can see the updated one. See, David role has been changed now to Azure Data Engineer. So how to update? We have seen that. Now let's see how we can add one new employee. So let me add one new employee is joining my organization. So I'm trying to add that. Employee. Employee name. Visualization engineer. And which location she belongs to. So this attachments, this is an optional only, so you need not enter anything. So once I click on this submit. 
automatically new record will be created. So you can check that in the source to check that always once you refresh this and check if you see now new employee record has been created. So we have seen how we can update how we can add new entry. Now let's see how we can delete some entry. OK, so employee uh, Chand, right? He has left my organization, so I want to remove his record from my source. So just I'm clicking this delete this item. So his record has been deleted. You can see that here as well. Once you refresh this, you can see no more uh, Chand is available here. He has left my organization. So without writing single uh, line of code, I have achieved. I have created a user friendly app for all my requirements using Power Apps. Thank you for watching this. For more informative videos, please do like, share and subscribe to KSR Data Vision YouTube channel. Thank you.